make sure I got full clips and all my weapons. I know a little about strong weaponry. Mind if I take a look at your railgun? Okay, what do you got in mind? Over penetration, huh? Well, I hope I can get these guys to stand in a straight line. Still, I better not plan for it. After all, no plan survives first contact with the enemy. Just when I think the straw can't sink any lower, I see shit like this. Well, we are going pretty far down. Is this what the straw can't plan for all of us if they take over the Earth? Well, they'll turn some of us into wall decor for a Nine Inch Nails video. Others, well, they get cyberfucked and turned into full-blown straw. Why? Why would the straw do this? Yeah, just going out on a limb here, at least the limbs I have left, I'd say the straw don't see us as a civilization to be conquered, but I think to them we're either food or spare parts. Something about that gives me the creeps. Don't touch it. I don't know about you, but I don't have an overwhelming urge to reach out and touch something that will actively try to kill me. I don't see any instructions, so I can't RTFM if there's no M to FR. Okay, that sounded big. That better have been part of the structure falling in. If that sound was made by something stroggy, then I really don't want to be facing something big in close quarters. Ah, shit! Uh, uh oh, um, are, are you okay? Uh, I guess not. Uh, um, it's okay, guys. It was like this when I found him. Last thing I need is a friendly fire incident. I hope it's just the lighting in here making these wounds look fresh. Anyway, what did they say in scout school? Ah yes, effects have causes. If he's dead, that means something killed him. If he was up there, something put him there. Now I just hope that he actually rotted and fell apart. Ah, squibs on the floor above us. Well, I hope their footfalls account for the, uh... I have a corpse dropping from the ceiling. This place is really turning up the creepy factor in a big way. And now we go from creepy to hokey. Guess it's time for another disgusting robo McShake. Ugh. Maybe this place has another one of those giant pulsating scrotums I saw earlier. I don't know, maybe the Macron has a thing for haunted houses. Oh no, the sinister coolant leaks. I don't think these guys are even trying anymore. Ah, fuck! Okay, that was actually very well played for Shock Factor. Damn it. That was one of those Pokeball shedding dogs. Now I guess we're gonna have to find it and neuter it before it breeds a litter of squibs. You know, it's places like this that bring back a lot of memories from being a kid and being afraid of monsters in the dark, only here it's much worse. To answer Rebecca Jordan's question, there are real monsters. Okay, and what the fuck is up with that moaning noise? I've already dealt with robo-zombies. I don't need robo-ghosts on top of that. And while we're on the topic, first robo-vampire I see, I'm gonna make Sparkle with a fucking canister of napalm. Ah, that looks promising. What the hell? Is that a girl straw? He's unconscious, maybe we can save- OH SHIT! Uh, maybe not. Cybered up and completely strong fucked in the head. This chick is definitely not my type. What the? Come on, no fair, that's cheating! He's a cheating bitch, too! Well, if these women are damaged goods, then I guess nobody will mind if I damage them a little more! Okay, she came out of one of those things on the wall. We passed a whole bunch on the way in here. Oh, great! I'm in the Strog Brothel. And now, me and my squad, are surrounded by an army of Strogstitutes. Welcome to Strogos, the only place in the universe where safe sex not only means condoms, but a copy of Norton Antivirus. Hopefully this has a desirable effect. Hey, this is Hollenbeck. Good job. The TSDs are being redeployed. 
Did he just say the testes are being deployed? Oh, on this planet, I would not be at all surprised. So I guess moving all these body parts around turns the lights back on. I don't suppose the Macron's ever heard of something called a light switch? What the hell are you guys shooting at? Oh, yeah, back. Uh, ha! Missed! Guess I didn't miss you. You okay? Don't be dead, okay? Otherwise, it does not look good on my performance review. It's clear. Shit, not a... Oh, it's empty. Uh, oh, jeez, look, we're customers! Welcome to the Strog House of Ill Repute. For a good time, call 1-800-FUCK-YOU. Thank you for coming. Here's your receipt. Don't forget to fill out our survey online for a chance to win. Aw, oh, come on. Look, lady, leave me alone. I like women. I'm not interested in cybered up psycho bitches. I really do not want to show up on sick call with a case of sexually transmitted spyware. If that happened, Morris would never let me hear the end of it. Oh, Kane, you were chatting it up with all the strong women. That would just suck. You better stay closed. What did I just say? Come on, like I said before, I am not interested. N-O-T. Wonderful. The Pokeball shitting dog in the Strog brothel. What kind of sick fetishes do they think I have? And it just gave birth to a space monkey? How the hell does that work? Come on! When I say sex equals false, I mean sex equals false! Jeez, these Strogstitutes must be deaf, stupid, or both! When this war is over, Strogos is getting the mother of all sexual harassment suits. What part of I don't want a cyber do you not understand? Ow! Well, I guess I still have nerves there. Lucky me. You know, I thought Strogification was bad. But this whole place makes me feel violated. I have two words for this place. Glass Crater. We're sorry, but all the digi hookers are dead now. Please make an appointment for next time. Jamming your gun into a cargo tube will not get you laid any faster. You know, compared to this place, getting mutilated was a fucking joy. This place has been one long bad mental image. And I don't think any amount of brain bleach is going to wipe it from my memory. You know what? I think Rhodes was wrong. The hard part isn't going to be finding a girl that's willing to settle down with me. The hard part is that knowing a place like this ever existed, the hard part is that I'm never going to be aroused again. There will never ever be a hard part. In fact, if footage of this place ever got released back on Earth, I think humanity would probably go extinct. Way to fucking go, Strogos. Will you look at that? A hooker with an actual hook. Okay, eyes up, guys. We only saw one go down on us. Oh, God damn, I can't believe I said that. I wonder what's next. A robo pimp that's angry that I just killed off his entire staff? You know what? I'm done with this place. I am so fucking done with this place. You guys can stay here and contain the outbreak of digital herpes right in this very basement. Although you could probably patch my armor up first. Just a few seconds and you'll be right back into the fight. You good to go, Marine? Meanwhile, I'm getting the hell out of here. The only way I'm gonna come back here is to deliver a nuclear weapon. Oh wait! Rose likes blowing shit up. He can come back with a nuclear weapon. No wonder the Strog have to raid other planets for new bodies. Between this place and the hentai spiders, they sure know jack shit about how to do it the natural way. I bet even their cloning tanks committed suicide.